Hey guys, you want to upgrade your uh, your steel barn chain to a Oregon barn chain? A little thicker, a little nicer. Keep watching. Plus, we're gonna install the felling bars. We're right back. Hey guys, today we're going to upgrade the chain on this steel MS-180 from the, uh, the stock steel one, uh, which is 0 0.043 millimeter to 0 0.050 millimeter from Oregon. Now you'll notice the uh, MS-180 has their traditional, you know, the two nuts and the adjustment in the center. Uh, there's also MS-180C, which has, uh, there's like a, a plastic cap that spins out. I'm not real sure on that one, so you might have to Google around a little bit more or find another, another video. But, so, we have a new Oregon bar. Put this here. And then once you untangle the chain from the box, once you open the box, that's a crazy, that's a crazy thing that uh, that plastic box that it comes in. Um, they have it tacked all down, like like someone's gonna steal it. But so this is a uh, 16 inch advanced cut. Uh, I'll put a, a link down below for this guy if you're interested. And I mean, there's nothing wrong with this chain. It's brand new. It's cut maybe three trees, um, but I just, I don't know. I always want to upgrade things, so let's go ahead and do this. And while we have it apart, I'm actually going to do, I got the uh, bumper bar attachment as well. So all we're going to be using is this, the tool that came with the saw. Let me go ahead and... Uh, Unscrew these guys. And I'm just going to put them right here on the orange guy so I don't lose them. Take this cap off. And here we go. Chain. All right, so here's the old guy. I'm just going to set him just like that so I can see it. So I wanted to add, well, I had the chain off. I wanted to add um, about the felling bar, full bar, attachment guy. So while I have him off, I'm trying to see if these are threaded already or not. I don't think they are. So what we want to do here. We're going to use both. Put them right here. This will give you a grip on the uh, the logs that you're. Oh, here he goes. That you're cutting down. So, screw it in a little bit. Back it off a little bit. Screw it in a little bit. Back it off a little bit. You don't want to use a power tool for this. All right. Started him. Let me start this guy. Same same idea. This might be a Torx 15. Screw in a little bit. Pull it off a little bit. Screw in a little bit. Pull it off a little bit. And these I got on Amazon. I think it was like fifteen dollars. So. Basically, you just don't want to crack this plastic frame here. You probably could just screw them down all the way. 
but I want to, if they're not threaded, I, and they don't look threaded, the holes. So I just want to make sure I'm not breaking this new saw. All right, that should do it. This one. So again, I'm going in a, like three turns, four turns, coming out two, going in three or four turns, coming out two. And now we're, I feel we're just about through. I'm just going to tighten it down now. Tighten this guy down. Like that. So it came with two. I just doubled them up. Next, took our new organ bar and chain. Organ, Oregon. Line him up. So everybody's happy. Take the cover. Put him back on. Lightly put on the, uh, the nuts, like hand tight if that. We can set it back down. What I want to do now is pull up on it. Pull up on the bar. And we want to adjust that. You see how how uh, loose it is right now? So I'm actually going to, since I can see better this way, you won't be able to see better, but I can. I'm going to go ahead and so you can see it's getting tighter as I turn it. I'm, I'm putting slight pressure upwards as I'm doing this. I want to be able to, to move it so that might be too tight. Now it looks good because now it's actually came out of its little thing there. Get in your hole. There we go. Alright, so I'm going to give it a little bit more tightness. So you want to be able to do this. You can wear gloves if you want. But you don't want to be able to pop out. I might go a tiny bit tighter. And just carry this guy with you. If you're out in the woods or somewhere, you have one little boop turn and then tighten these guys down like you mean it. And that's it. As long as you can move it with your hand, you can go like this. Might be a little, actually a little too tight, but being a, a new uh, a new chain, it's going to loosen up a little bit. So that's it. So the upgrades here got the organ chain, well organ bar, the chain, and the new uh, felling bar because it, it comes with the plastic one, but that's just going to rub away. So this MS one eighty is a great saw, love it, and uh, going to set this aside. I'll use it at some point, but the Oregon one's a little bit thicker, 0 0.050 instead of 0 0.043, and uh, brand new sharp. Can't wait to use it. See you next time.